when i received the email that my work was getting shortlisted i'm like this image needs to be printed being shortlisted in itself is a win for me because if you see the caliber of people that are judging the entries oh my god i'm talking curators of like the national portrait museum gallery in london huge 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 british mostly british brand because it is a british award but it's a global entry so i went down to the print store and i said hey printer man i need you to print out this image for me initially he said it's 16 by 20 but i said no i want it ginormous i want it humongous and i want it massive so we went for a 24 by 36 print the printer man printed out the image and i asked how much it would cost to frame the print it was 700 dollars <laughs> So I humbly walked down to Ikea and selected the biggest frame at Ikea. Eager to hang my art, I unwrapped the frame, unscrolled my print, and ready to put up my masterpiece and what would you know the print was too big for the frame and just like a light in a mirror i realized that my framed cezanne print was a perfect match to my print what is an 1800 french painter paul cezanne to a original chisomukoye got my screwdriver ready to hang my masterpiece again and the glass of the frame broke <laughs> Now I have two prints that are really large and no frame. I tried to walk down to the thrift store. Didn't find any frames I like, but I did find this nice piece of art that I took home with me. And so my journey for framing my art continues.